All right, welcome back to Perizno, Dwarves Only. We're back at it with another episode. In the last one, we laid siege to Kahadir Keep, and we took it back from the Trahara. And now we are back at war with the Trahara. We fought uh, one of their guys and captured him as well. And uh, I'm pretty sure we got, yeah, we've got two of their lords prisoner. Our army is looking solid. And I think we would start out with besieging this castle, so let's take a look here. I just want to see if it's a ladder assault or if it's a... Okay, it's a siege tower assault. Uh, it would take 90 hours, and we don't have any engineering skill. So I think what we're going to actually do... Also, I'm worried that we're going to get attacked while waiting that long, and we don't have anyone else here to support us. And so, I think what we're going to do is actually go and try to find a uh, Baramber, our guy, our engineering guy. And I feel like we might be able to find him if we go to... Oh, here's another guy. I think we can definitely beat this guy, but I don't know if we're going to catch up to him. Okay, a scout comes up ri uh, riding up to you and tells you to find a man on a tree. Um, let's just untie him, gain honor and renown. Let's see if we can catch this guy. I don't think we have the speed to, to catch him. Yeah, he's outrunning us. But let's see, can we get Ulius die patrol? Alright, we got 25 guys. Let's just beat up on the Draharans to start out the episode. I'm gonna have everyone follow me. And I'm pretty sure that, um... If we can get Baramber, then it'll... We'll be able to lay siege to castles much more quickly. Let's just give the order to charge and take these guys out. Uh, dismounted that guy. Alright. Let's just be careful not to shoot our allies. We got a good amount of cav here as well, so I, I do like that we've got these wolf and tiger dwarfs with, with us now. Because that's something that you don't really... You don't really have a lot of good cavalry with the the vanilla dwarf troops. You've got the, noble, uh, the nobles you can hire from castles, but that's about it. Um, from castles and cities, I should say. Oh, man. There we go. There we go. Let's take out this, uh, Shadow Assassin. Or what is he? Is he, uh... Yeah, he's Desert Assassin. There we go. Good job, guys. Good job. Let's take... Let's bring him down. Very good, very good. Come on. Whoop. There we go. And yeah, we can also get, you can basically get the iron fists to ride around on those uh, goats as your cavalry, but looks like we're pretty much chasing down the last guy. There's like maybe two guys left. Very good. And I'm feeling good about the direction of this playthrough now. I think if we can wipe out Jahara from the map, then we can take on... Um, we could definitely take on the Hakon next. And if we can play them off each other, so we can get them to weaken each other as well. Oh, whoops. I gotta not... There we go. Just keep tabbing out of the window. Alright, we didn't take any casualties. Very good. They had some of these guys. Who cares? Let's take the prisoners. Holy moly, they had a lot of these guys. We'll take them. Let's get, uh, yeah, let's get an elite scout, sure. More, more cavalry. And this guy is also a cavalry archer. Very cool. Alright, let me take some loot here. Yeah, we gotta sell our loot as well, so I think we're just going to head back towards Crane. And then we'll resume fighting. But yeah, somehow the dwarves were able to capture this <laughs> from the Drahara. But we gotta coordinate with the other armies if we want any chance in this war. Okay, let's just sell all of this stuff. Uh, highlight all of this. Can they afford it? Yeah, they should be able to. Okay, good. And let's get some food as well. What should we get? Ooh, exquisite butter. Ooh, exquisite bread. Sure, we'll get that. And then I'm going to visit the tavern. Let's see, is Baramber in here? I'm sure we'll find him eventually. Ransom broker. Oh yeah, let me sell all my prisoners. 8,600. Very good, very good indeed. What the hell? I, I gotta stop doing that. Why do I keep... I keep uh, tabbing out of the window. Alright, 
Let's leave. Let's, um, let's see. Okay, Arish. I guess we can go visit there next. Um, and then I think we'll go back on the offensive. I just want to check the tavern and get Barambra for that engineering skill, because that'll really help with laying siege. I do not see... Alright, he's not in here. Um, okay, I guess we could go check Amarna, but then after that I think we're going to just head back to the Drahara Desert area. And I really hope that we can get more fiefs so we can start sort of stocking them up with our own troops. And then we have a place to garrison soldiers so we can hire men, train them up, garrison them for later, and so on and so forth. How are we doing on upgrades? Yeah, we can get some upgrades. Uh, let's get a Highland Crossbowman. More Cav. Very good. How many freaking wolf? And yeah, we got a lot of cavalry now. This is looking solid. It's going to really help us against those uh, more mobile cavalry-based armies. What's going on over here? Third Legion. Okay. Uh, Elentor. Okay. Alright, let's just head back. And... This guy's uh, t attacking our village, so we have to go respond. I think we're going to just try to f get into as many battles with the Traharans as we can. Here's another one. We can catch this guy. And he's got a ton of prisoners as well. Alright. Very good. Let's take him out. Alright, good. Everybody follow me. How is it raining? Why is it raining? The sky is blue. Weird. It's a sunny day, but somehow it's raining. I'm gonna give the order to charge. Let's just, uh, charge him in. Alright. Oh, man. Alright, let's go with the two-hander grip here. I do like that this Ancestral Longsword is flexible like that. Alright, let's bring, bring down some of these bastards. There we go. Come on. Let's go. There we go. Yeah, it's very weird that somehow it's raining, but it's a sunny day out here. But I think we're just going to be battling the Draharans this whole episode. That's kind of the plan right now. we got to take as much territory from them as possible and start expanding the Kaikoth out. we got to go from the defensive to the offensive here. And also the Xan are going to be attacking soon, and that's going to be causing problems for basically everyone. They're a very difficult faction to deal with once they arrive. Very powerful troops, and huge numbers. But I do think that we can beat them if we are able to organize a vigorous defense. There we go. Alright. I think that's basically most of them. Uh, let me give my boys a rally so we don't take any more casualties. Or at least so we can hopefully prevent any unnecessary losses. And, uh, yeah, they're gonna finish up the rest of them. Fortunately, we're building up a very nice contingent of cavalry to chase down the enemy here. Alright, I think we're doing good. There's just one, one more guy. There we go. Good job, guys. Alright, good job, guys. Alright, we took seven losses. Fortunately, we lost two Tiger Knights there. It's okay. We got a uh, Kaikoth Warrior. Sure, we'll take him. Take these as prisoners. Man, they really have a lot of these Sand Stalkers and Sand Walkers as prisoners. I think we'll... Uh, should we take them? I mean, I guess, I guess we could take them. Sure. We could get rid of them if we find better uh, prisoners. Let's get our upgrades. And we got another Tiger Paladin. Cool, cool. Get another crossbowman, more wolf knights, more tiger. Uh, there we go. Alright, uh, let's go to Crane and sell the prisoners right quick. And it's good that we're on peaceful terms with the 
hack on empire at the moment. 5,900, very good. As we can use their towns. Um, okay, Gomer got Bardak Castle. Hopefully he'll start awarding us some stuff. But let's go to our village. Alright, this guy's attacking Ganagweba. Let's try to... Sahib Ma Mahir. And we did start building a mercenary outpost there, so we can defend against attacks. Oh, 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 oh. Come on! Oh man, we just barely missed him. Oh, there we go, we got him. Um, surrender or die. Alright, everyone charge. Here they come on the hill. It seems like a lot of the Trahara armies are pretty small, but I'm I, I'm sure they have at least a, an army or two that is 100 plus troops. And if they can unite, then that's a big threat. As the dawn is breaking over the dunes, we are going to destroy these these idiots. God damn, they killed the Tiger Knight. Nice, look at that. Snipe down some of these assassin boys. Man, how am I missing all these shots? There we go. Uh, there we go. Okay. Yeah, I feel like maybe we should hold the cavalry back because they kind of charge out ahead of everyone and then they get overwhelmed easily. Come on, there we go. Can I get a hit on this guy? There we go. There we go. Alright, good, good, good. Almost done here. My troopers throwing their axes. Alright, come on. Let's let's finish the job. We'll look at the sun. Let's go take a look at the sunrise while our men finish the battle for us. Ah, beautiful. Beautiful sunrise. Very nice. Alright, we won. Good job, boys. We lost five. Two Tiger Knights. Yeah, it seems like our, we should hold back our cavalry. You win today, dog? Oh, you're going to talk like that to us? Okay, we'll take you as our prisoner. And let's capture some prisoners, take more loot, and be on our merry way. Um, some soldiers are ready to upgrade. Let's get more upgrades here. More Cav, more Tigers. You know how it goes. There we go. Uh... Okay, who do we? Who else we got here? This guy, Grasula, wants to fight. You want to fight? Yep, he wants to fight. Emir Grasula. Whoa, what kind of crazy armor is this guy wearing? Doesn't look much like a Trahara to me. Oh, good, good, good. Okay, let's um, let's take the hill. I think he actually is the aggressor here because he rode out to attack us. Infantry in front, cavalry get off to the side. Archers form up on the hill. Very good, very good. Cavalry charge. Okay. What the hell? Oh, there, that's the leader there. There, I got him. Emir Grasula. Alright. Oh, crap. Come on. Oh my god. Holy crap, these guys are strong. What is this unit even? I am not sure. Okay. There's a nice kill. Come on, hold them, hold them back, boys. Bring them down. 
Oh, a bunch of our reinforcements arrived. Just a bunch of wolves of materializing out of thin air is always awesome to see. Alright, let's bring these guys down. They're pretty tough, actually. I can see why this guy thought he, he had a chance of beating us. These are like elite Drahara troops. Oh, this guy's attacking me from behind. Come on, what you got? Oh, nice, nice. Yeah, these are Shadow Assassins. So this is uh, what that other castle had as its garrison. Let me give my boys a rally. Good, good, good. All the dead bodies are piling up. There we go. 865 experience for killing these guys. Holy crap. There we go. Oh man, our crossbows are doing work though. All that, all those bolts are flying. There we go, another kill. Alright, I'm gonna bring my cavalry back here. Cavalry, come back. We gotta pull them into this position. Cavalry, hold here. Keep firing, keep shooting, boys! There we go, dismount on that. Oh! Oh, crap, crap. Alright, my boys are just gonna have to finish the job now. But yeah, th these are really strong units. I mean, 865 experience for killing one is like a huge amount. But, oh man, we are going to take casualties here, but that's the end of the battle. We beat them. Good job, guys. Oh boy, we took 29 casualties there. He managed to escape, but we got some prisoners. Assassin sword, yeah. Let's look at this. Yeah, that's a pretty good sword as well. And we got a level up, so we're going to put that to Charisma and another point to Leadership. Now we can expand our army a little more. I'm going to just put these points. And I think we're going to have to go re recruit some more men. We took some casualties in that fight. And at least we got some more upgrades. How many, uh, let's see, Tiger Knights. We got eight of them now. Cool, cool. And here's the Dwarves. The Dwarves are out here in force. Very nice. Uh, I feel like we could just stick with them for the time being. Durzad is leading the force. But I don't know where they're going. Um, we could just stick with them and see what they do. But it doesn't look like they're marching. Onishi, a captain of the Zan Dynasty's leader, Zan Berserks, their goal is to cut a path through the, all the inhabitants of Prisno. Okay, well, they're, they're showing up. What are these guys doing? Are they fighting uh, the Desert Scourge? Oh, yeah, they are, they are. Uh, okay. What are you guys doing? This guy's running away. Uh, do we join this fight? Oh, uh, man. They have a lot of Mosaru. Uh, okay, I think we're just gonna join the fight. Okay, good, good. I think we can do this. I gotta heal my myself here. All right, let's. It's very misty. The battlefield is covered in a thick mist. Infantry hold this position. Cavalry hold this position. I don't know how many troops we were able to bring. Oh wait, no, don't. Retreat. Okay, all of my guys just form up here. Get ready to defend the hill. Oh my God! Huge army just stampeding out of the darkness, out of the misty fog. Oh man, there's a lot of them. I don't want to just shoot blindly into the mass, though. I want to take specific targets to snipe at. Alright, we're going to have to hold this. At least we got a really steep hill that neutralizes a lot of their ability to charge with the cavalry. Okay, let's try to... Okay. Oh man, there's a lot of them. I think we're doing alright, though. Man. 
Alright, at least we're gonna get rid of this unique spawn. I don't think I've ever fought this guy before. Tevia the Desert Scourge. Oh, head, head, survive the headshot. Okay, come on. That's a Warlord. Yeah. They got like a bunch of these Warlord guys. Alright, yeah. I'm just gonna stick by my by the side of my men here. Archers move up a little bit. There we go. Damn, okay. Yeah, we were only able to bring in like a small handful of troops to this fight because our allies are bringing the bulk of it. Oh man, just more waves, endless waves of troops are pouring out. Okay, more of our reinforcements are here. Okay. Alright. Oh. Reload. Yeah, I feel like just letting the AI do most of the work here. But I'm just seeing more and more red clumps materializing on the map in the top right corner there. They're just pouring in. There we go, bring him down. Alright, miss. There we go. Oh my god! Look at them all, they're just charging out of the freaking mist. At least the allies are really putting in work for us here. If we, if we didn't have them, then this would be a nightmare. There we go. Alright, let me heal up. Let me rally the boys here. Okay. Good shooting, good shooting. There we go, another headshot. Come on. Alright. Alright. Yeah, aim for their kneecaps. There we go. Or their head. That works too. And, uh... Holy moly, there's just so many. Oh my god, okay, this is starting to get a little scary with all the projectiles flying. Oh, come on. Come on. I'm trying to do the jump attacks on him. Alright, cavalry, you guys can go out and charge. I want you moving around here. Okay, okay. Oh my god. Well, at least if we win this, this unique spawn will be taken off the map. Oh. Alright, just hold the ground, man. Hold them here. There we go. Oh. Yikes, yikes. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Alright, I gotta heal myself. I gotta rally as well. There we go. There we go. Oh my god. How many of these guys do they have? I think their numbers were like 576 or something. It's gonna take a while to bring them all down. Another epic hill defense like we had uh, in episode 9. But 
We just gotta hold out. I don't know how many uh, of the AI are still helping us, or if they've lost all their men. There we go. Man, their horses also have a lot of health, honestly. Right, can I heal? Oh my god. Okay, I'm out of ammo for the crossbow. I could borrow some if I have an archer. But yeah, just holding the high ground is so advantageous against cavalry because they're they're totally unable to charge uphill. Especially with a really big steep one like this. So we're really lucky with the map. Good, good, good. Alright, yeah, we're we're gonna we're gonna win. I think we're on the on the last ones here. I, I still see a few al uh, AI allies running around here too. So that they weren't all killed. Yeah, they're all scattered around the map now though. Hmm. Alright. This guy's moving out, mountain warrior. Alright. More fighting over here. Okay, why don't we just give the order to charge? Archers charge, infantry charge. There we go. Just an arrow floating in this air right there. Very cool. Alright. Don't really know what to say. I'm just waiting for this to be over now. Because I don't think they're spawning in any more enemies. I only see like one or two more red dots on the map in this direction. There we go, we did it. Alright. Good job, boys. Well done. We lost three Tiger Knights. Um, our allies lost 59, we killed 265. Now we have 340 against a 255. So now the sun is rising, it's time for another battle. Let's get a little bit of healing to start out. What is that unit? The Kaikoth Dreyer Guard? Dreargd. No idea. Let's put our archers on the hill. Infantry here. Cavalry can charge. Alright, we didn't get as good a hill here, though. So this is going to be tough. Alright, let me stay with my men. Oh, man. I really don't like all the projectiles that are playing. Oh, crap. Holy crap. Oh my god. Alright. We don't have as good a hill this time. But I think we can hold on. Jesus. See how they can just trample over you and knock you on the ground. Alright boys. The sun is rising on the battlefield today. There we go. There we go. Oh my gosh, they really do have a lot of archers though. Oh man, I was gonna use the horse as cover, but they just killed the horse. Mm. There we go. There we go. Oh my gosh. There we go. This my shooting isn't too bad. Seems like they have a lot of these uh Mosoru uh maiden cavalry, uh There we go. Alright, let me get another heal. Let me rally the boys. There we go. 55 troops recover. 30% of hit points. It's so good. Definitely use that if you're playing Prisno. It's such an advantageous thing to do. There's more more enemies coming in. I'm in a freaking duel with this lady. Oh, what you got? What you got? What you got? That was slick. 
Just keep near our troops. Okay. There we go. I feel like my crossbow sniping has been pretty solid. Oh! Let's take this guy out. I do like this unit though, the Dreyarg. I think he upgrades from the uh, the like pickaxe guy. The two-handed pickaxe guy. But I'm not sure. There might be a household troop, actually. There we go. Oh, man. They have so many. Wait. Oh, can I get a rally? Alright, there we go. Oh my god. Gonna run out of ammo pretty soon here, though. Alright. We're still gonna win this, but we are gonna take casualties in this in the process. And then I think we might just uh, have to go back to... Mercenary Guild and get more troops, or to Kaikoth and get more troops. Man, they just keep coming. We do outnumber them at least at this point. Alright, only two shots here left. Alright. Yeah, I think the best is just to keep my guys in the clump so they charge in and get swamped like that. Yeah, just get swallowed up by my boys, my Iron Guardsmen and so on. Alright, these guys are dismounted, let's go for them. There we go. Uh-oh! Feeling like Jon Snow with just like pulling out my sword while a bunch of cavalry just charge around me. <laughs> oh. Alright, let's go. There we go. Man. This is a really big freaking battle. I wonder what we get for defeating this unique spawn though. Because I've never, I don't think I've ever beaten this unique spawn, or even seen it before. Let's get a rally. Alright, yeah, when you do the rally, it keeps you stuck for a little while, so... Gotta be careful with that. Oh, this guy is out here by himself. Let me help you, buddy. I just jumped over him while swinging my sword. There we go. There we go. Battle Rider, yeah. Alright, I think this is the last batch and then we'll have this whole thing finished, finally. We're almost done here, guys. It's just really hard when they keep riding away and... We have so many foot troops that it's hard to chase them down. Which is partially why I started focusing on cavalry for the mercenary troops. As I've explained. But, yeah, there we go. Let's get a heal. Alright, I think we're almost done here. Come on, finish him. There we go, and that's it. We did it. And the sun is rising on our victory. Alright, good job, guys. We lost two. 217 enemies killed. Your help was most welcome. I'm Morund. My name is Skagic Mudbrew. This guy doesn't even know me, and I'm a lord. You'll not live long to enjoy your victory. My kinsmen will soon wipe out the stain of this defeat. Well, we caught Tevi of the Desert Scourge. 
damn you, you will regret this. And look at this, we can get all these guys we liberated as our own troops. We got Dreyarch and Elite Halberdiers and High Seekers and stuff. This is great. So we'll take these guys. Iron Fist will take. Kaikoth Warrior. Halberdier. Seeker. Uh, Kaikoth Footman, sure. Clansman. And... Okay. And then we got a whole bunch of prisoners as well. We'll take as many as we possibly can take. Yes! Look at all these guys. Holy moly. So many freaking prisoners, man. Now let's take this. Alright, cool, cool. Party capacity reach, that's okay. Any other... Kaikoth troops? Yeah, we'll take these guys. And I think that's it for now. Very good. Okay. We can take some loot as well. Very good. Uh, what else? Anything else we could get rid of? Yeah, let's get rid of this. I'll take this. This and take this. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. A lot of good loot, though. We'll get rid of this stuff. And take this and this and this and this. And I think I'm satisfied with that. Alright! Very good. Very good victory there. Let's uh, upgrade some more of our guys. And we actually captured that uh, the Desert Scourge herself. You there. Me, Gulp. Um, get back in line. Okay. <laughs> Alright, let's see. How are we doing? Um, I feel like this has been pretty good. We were able to defeat the Desert Scourge. I guess we'll take these prisoners back. And then I think we're going to go to the Mercenary Guild and get more guys. Who's this guy? That's the Vizier of the Trahara. He's got 202 troops. Let me do a save here. And uh, let's bring this back to Crane. And, oh man, this guy's... The Vizier is attacking our village. So we're going to have to go defend the village again. Let's go to the tavern. Sell off the prisoners. And some broker. Sell all the prisoners. 15,000. Very nice. Very good. And, let's see, we're going to have to replenish our forces. I think we run over to Mercenary Guild now. And then I think we'll just head back, we're going to head back to the Fief, and I think then that might be it for today. But, let me just go get more troops here. And we got a point to leadership, so we can actually have a bigger army as well now. Oh, oh, hello. Kaikoth Mountain Keeper. Alright, we'll take this guy. Very nice. And, uh, okay. Let's go talk to Ingvar again. We're gonna fill out our army. 131 men. And let's head back to our village. I'm gonna do a save here. Even though I just saved, I'll do another save here. And let's head to Ganeguiba. It's being raided once more by the leader of the Trahara faction. But let's head back in that direction. Trahara offers you 4,600. Uh, sure, we'll take it. We'll take the money. And our money is looking really good now, too. Oh yeah, we also gotta sell our loot. Let's do that. Let me go here. Very good. And then we'll sell this stuff too. Very good, very good indeed. Alright, how are we doing on money? Almost 150,000. Money is definitely not an issue for us at the moment. We just gotta get our guys upgraded enough to... to fight. But yeah, Ganeguiba was looted. Um... Manage the village. We're still building the guard post. 
and it doesn't let us actually repair the village, unfortunately, but I think in the next episode, we're going to keep up our war against the Drahara. I think we'll call it there for today, and thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope to catch you all in the next one. Peace.